So I just got done smoking a blunt, watching episode 6 of season 4 Damachi part 2. If you haven't seen Damachi, I highly recommend it. That's a really good anime. But that's not what we're here to talk about. So I was about to get on stream. I was about to grind Apex Legends. You know, I'm trying to solo queue, trying to get another master badge when it comes to Apex Legends and ranked arenas. And I started to realize that I don't really enjoy playing Apex Legends anymore. Like, I'm not having fun playing the game. I feel like every time now, when I get on Apex Legends to sit there and to grind rank arenas to solo queue the Masters because I want another Master Best, I feel like I am so stressed out and so frustrated when it comes to playing this game and dealing with randoms. The solo queuing experience and playing with the randoms is so bad and it's so stressful. And I know people are like, yo, Reloves, man, you just gotta have fun. You gotta take it with a grain of salt. And I don't think people understand that don't grind Apex Legends at a very high level and take the game very serious. Like, my dream is I wanna play in the Asia Less. I wanna go pro in Apex Legends. I won tournaments from Apex Legends. Now, I'm not here to brag or anything, but I'm just trying to make a point. Like, I feel like I have goals that I want to reach as a player and accolades that I want to achieve as a player when it comes to playing Apex Legends and one of those goals and accolades I want to achieve is I want another master badge and I feel like trying to solo queue ranked arenas because I've been solo queuing ranked arenas for a very long time and I just get to diamond three and then I just don't move up like right now I'm in diamond three again and then last season I was halfway through diamond three and then I dropped down all the way to d4 because of randoms and it's like it's just so fucking frustrating because I'm sitting here Grinding this game every single day, every single day, bro. I'm dedicating my life to my craft. I want to go pro in Apex Legends, and I know the only way for me to do that is to sit here and grind every single day. But I feel like when I solo queue in Apex Legends, I'm just so stressed out, bro, because my randoms don't know how to rotate, bro. Don't know how to shoot their gun. Can't get more than a thousand damage. I talk about this all the time. I feel like I'm beating a dead horse when I talk about this, bro. Like, to be honest with you, and I'm making this video because this video, it just goes to show, like, my love and passion for Apex Legends and what it is, like, the real side of what it comes to trying to sit there and grind Apex Legends and play this game every single day at its highest level. This shit is fucking stressful. It's frustrating. It's annoying. I feel like when you three stack, you know what I'm saying, you eliminate all the problems when you sit there and you try to three stack at Apex Legends. But as a solo queue player, it's so difficult to find teammates. I'm not even going to lie to you. It's so hard to find teammates at Apex Legends. And it's just sad when I think about it that I'm not having fun on Apex Legends because I really, really like Apex Legends. Apex Legends is a phenomenal game. One of the best shooter games ever created. Apex Legends sisters up there with some of my best games of all time. Devil May Cry, Near Autonomous, Years of War, Halo 3, Apex Legends. It sits on that pedestal because it's a really good fucking game. Now, the thing that is like making me not enjoy the game is the fact that I constantly get matched up with players that don't know how to play the game or don't take the game as serious as I take the game. Yes, I understand not everybody wants to be a pro in Apex Legends, I get that. But as somebody that is trying to play Apex Legends at its highest level and compete in professional tournaments when it comes to Apex Legends, I want to sit there and achieve my smaller goals, which would be to get another Masters. Like, I already hit Masters in Season 12, and it's like, if I hit Masters in Season 12, why have I not hit Master again? I should be hitting Master every rank split. But because I'm solo queuing and I'm getting the worst teammates possible, I have no control over how much AP I'm going to lose or how much AP I'm going to gain in a day. Like you said, the best comparison I can give you when it comes to solo queuing ranked arenas and it comes to these randoms is I feel like I'm playing the lottery, bro. I feel like one of the people that go to 7-Eleven and be like, all right, man, let me get a 8 8 Now over to the three-way. Let me get a 454 dollars $50 box and just hoping one day that they numbers is going to come out. You're spending so much money on these numbers. Knowing that you may not potentially win. One day you might win them $1,000. And the other day you might walk away with a negative 500 That's how it is when it comes to solo queuing ranked arenas inside of Apex Legends. 
Now do y'all see why your boy Reloads is not having fun? One day you may get some good randoms, and then the next day you may get some randoms where you don't even know if these motherfuckers even passed elementary school. They can't tell the difference between left and right. Holy shit, son. But man, I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Make sure you guys hit that like button. Subscribe to For Ghost of Entertainment with all your notifications turned on. And don't forget to follow us on social media at For Ghost of underscore and and at It's Reloads on Twitter. Link down below in the description. And we'll see you guys on the next one. We go right here. We're we have to move, but we're gonna move back right here. Enemy there. Go to the right. They soft, bro. They're fucking terrible. You're right, bro. That button to your right. I've secured the banner. They get a second Oops. chance. No, you might be able to pull this off. You might as well ask right here. Now we're gonna get your shit. We're gonna fuck it. Fight this shit out of this game. Get the fuck out of here. Get the Free fuck out of here. Watch this, watch this. Uh, direct, uh, directly to your right, kind of. Down the ass, ass, yeah, down the ass. Down the ass? Okay, okay. I'm gonna floor kill her, I'm gonna floor kill her so you can grab her shit. So you can grab your shit. Oh, behind me, behind me. Yeah, you come to me, you can come to me, just come to me, come to me. Yo, come to me, come to me, come to me, I'm safe, I'm safe, we gotta res me real quick. Two enemy squads still breathing. Hurry up, sir, I'm ready. Yo, do you have a bat? Yes. Drop me back, drop me back. Come on, heal, heal, heal. Right behind you, bro. Bat. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Oh, yeah. oh, headshots, headshots! Yo, she level queued on top of you. You're good to heal, you're good to heal. Yo, she dropped, she dropped, she dropped. She's on one shot. I like how that shit says for Gosa A is the champion. That shit fire. You are the Apex champions. Your flights out here knowing how to play the game, bro.